Dear viewer, make sure you click on the subscribe button and the notification bell. And be the first to watch new videos of Apostle John Chi. Watch and be blessed. Name of Jesus Christ. So you, you, you are to rescue that family. Why are you beating her? You are to rescue the family for what? Why are you beating her? No, sir. Who asked you to come here? Huh? Huh? You, are you angry you that she came that here? You can do that. Huh? You think you are can you do that? Are you angry that she came here? I've been there for many years. Nobody saw me. She, she was blessed with a, a, a touch in this church. She said, "My, this is my head to shine. I must shine. She light a touch like this on her head. She said, I must shine. She must this shine. Year. Now she you darkness disappear. She has started building. You darkness disappear. Project for many years. I've oh, been here. Oh, she loves the things of God. I don't like it. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Glory be to Master Jesus Christ. Amen. Vient de recevoir sa délivrance dans le nom puissant. My name is Ashu Timbu Bridget. I'm a Cameroonian, but I base in Guinea Equatorial in Malabo. The person standing next to me is. My auntie's husband, he's just like a father to me because they are the people who brought me up. The problem that brought me here was spirit of anger, disappointment in marriage, near success syndrome, rising and falling, and evil attacks. The spirit of anger made me to fight one day with a girl. The girl came to our house, so we had a little argument, so we started fighting. And the girl wanted to pierce my eye with her hand. So the finger mistakenly entered into my mouth. And I beat the finger in such a way that the finger almost fell down. So I was taken to the gendarmerie and I was locked up there. The anger also affected my business in a way that when customers come to my saloon, they will stand and they will first of all look at me if I'm in the mood. Then they will enter my saloon to do their hair. If just, just look at my face and they notice that I'm not in the mood. When I say the mood, I mean when I'm angry. When they say that I'm angry, they will just go. In my relationship, I used to chase men away when they come to ask for my hand in marriage. Before coming here, me and my father here, we had a little misunderstanding with his wife. So my children were living with them. I went and took my children from them. And I said, I will never forgive them. And I will never go to their house. And they will never see my children. Because I never want to have any conversation with them, I deleted their numbers. So that is what the spirit of anger did in my life. So I was looking for solution because I knew it was not normal. And I came here straight to the ark of God's ministry. The day that I came here, I was place uh, at the power room. Before entering there, all of my body began to itch, began to itch. So I stood there, and when Apostle John Chi was coming, I saw his face. His face was very smooth, like 
the face of a newborn baby. So something told me that I should run and go this way like this. So I wanted to run, and they held me. So from there, I just heard that, sister, you are delivered. And I said, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> After my deliverance, I felt so light. The first thing after my deliverance, this is my father here. I went to his house. So he saw me. He called for the wife that come home. Bridget is here. So my auntie came. When she came, she saw me. She started crying. And she said, thank God for Apostle John. She thank God for your deliverance. She was telling me that thank God for my deliverance. They were not expecting me. So they were very happy when they saw me. So the following day, I took my children. I went to their house after so many years that they saw my children, and they were very, very happy. They celebrated with me for my deliverance. <laughs> so after my deliverance, I went to Yaounde to do the passport. So they told me that I should come and sign. I went and I signed. They said, after some days, they will call for me. So I went back. And I used this torch to pray. I used it like this. I said, 2020 is my year to shine. I must shine in the name of Jesus. So immediately they called for me that, Madam, where are you? I said, I'm outside. I'm standing at the gate. They said, just come in. And I went in. So they took my fingerprint. They snapped me. So I went there and I collected the passport. This is the passport. My advice to viewers all over the world is that if you notice that what you are doing is not correct, please run and seek for your deliverance. My name is Njinga Joseph, by his grace. The person standing beside me is my daughter. I am here to confirm my daughter's behavior before and now. Because before, she was just like a lioness. We had uh, some misunderstanding. For some years back, the children were with me. She came and collected the children and gave to a stranger, and of which we don't know the person. But we were surprised to see her on that day after her deliverance. She came and she presented us, the children, with her. And so all of us were rejoicing and we were glad. Her ways of behaviors now has totally changed. She has become a newborn baby now. The way she talks to people now, very calm and humble, and I appreciate it. So I want to thank the Almighty God for the man of God, Apostle John Chi, for delivering her from this spirit. My promise to God is to serve him all the days of my life.